Hey guys, I'm back. Today I'm gonna show you how to lay brick for beginners. First, we're gonna start by spreading the mortar. Before I jump into the video, go ahead and give your boy Ryan a thumbs up. And subscribe if you haven't already subscribed for more coin video like this one. Let's get into it. All right, so we're gonna part our mortar. You wanna dish your mortar just like so. Take it up, you wanna take up a pretty good amount. You want to position your trowel right over your brick. So you see the brick here, you want to go ideally right here in line with the wall and the brick. You're going to go down, try to shake off just enough that we need for here. And we're going to continue on. I'm going to do it right now. So we shake like that, shake again, shake again, shake. Just like that. Now we're going to, we're going to try to part the middle so that way we can fill the outer space. So like here that doesn't have any mortar, we're gonna do it like this. Just like that. We're gonna cut it off. Put it here, clear your cavity as you go. I'm gonna do a few more so that way you catch it. butter our brick to install it right there so we're gonna put it just like that but before we do that we need to butter here the way we're gonna butter it we're gonna plaster the face like just like that after we plaster the face we go down then we go from the up we go down like that we have a full joint we want to try to match it with the, the joint that's lower down so the size you have here is the same size you want to have here so I, I'm, all I'm doing right now, I'm just rubbing my hand right like so, just to get it down to the level, to the level of the line. Then I'm going to cut this away, cut it away, so that way we can use this to butter our next brick. I'm going to lay our brick now. We want to line up this brick with the existing one that's on it here. So whatever joint is going here is the same joint you want to put down here. Cut the model that we can use to lay our next brick. Once I take the model like this, I shake my trowel. Reason why I shake my trowel because I don't want it to fall off. As you see, I have it. If I turn it upside down, it won't fall off. So I shake it to get the gravity onto my trowel. As you see, I take it up, I shake. You notice I rub it like this to get it down. It's way faster than you knocking it down. A few guys do it differently. A few guys would go like this. The time it takes to knock down, you could lay five brick. So I rub it down. This way is more faster in my opinion. You can try both ways and see which one works better for you. important to follow your band make sure every now and again you can check like this just to make sure that both bricks are in line with each other with your trowel you want to maintain your band as you go you want to rub your brick down try to get the bottom with the existing one that's already laid and slowly bring the brick as close as to the line as possible as you can get it just a fraction space just like this away from the line And you need to go watch this video and get all my spray the mark. 
So the way how I spread the water, I dig it like this and I drag my hand. So I drag it like this so that I can get it further. But the mala, you have to have the right consistency in order to get it to, to spread the way how I spread. My mala is, could be a little bit softer. This is another way to bother your brick. You hold it like this. They do like that, that way it don't fall off. Just like you see, trying to get it to flush with the bottom. See, I try to try to mark the bottom. Try to, I try to bring the bottom to the existing one, then I cut it. from this video go ahead and give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more point video like this one don't go away watch one of those videos pretty sure you'll learn something thank you for watching